Hello guys, Rogue here, and welcome back to... Well, not welcome back, but welcome to a new Let's Play, um, Tomb Raider 2. Before I start blubbing on about it, I'm gonna go straight into the game, so you're not missing stuff. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. Enjoy the cutscene. So this level is called the Great Wall. As you can tell, it's uh, the Great Wall of China. At least I think so, anyway. But yeah, this is the second installment of Tomb Raider. Why she's not looking up at the helicopter? Yep, that's the helicopter she just jumped off of. And as soon as you touch this water, a tiger comes. <laughs> Bitch! Alright, so as I was saying, this is the second installment of Tomb Raider, and I missed that. You don't get up this way, but I like to make it a challenge. There we go. Alright, um... This one... Uh, I'm trying to say something, but I can't quite think. Oh shit, that was close. I know, Tigers, you're down there. Alright, this is the first secret. You collect dragons. Uh -huh. And for everything you pick up, she's like, uh huh. It, it kind of grates on you a little bit, but you know, it's Tomb Raider. It's not that bad. What am I trying to say? Oh, this Tomb Raider focuses on uh, Lara traveling around the world trying to find a artifact that gives someone the power of a fire-breathing dragon. It's quite interesting, this one. But then again, so was the first one. Finding the last city of Atlantis and uh, all that stuff. Ah, shit. Yeah, uh, there's flares and uh, twisty jumps and everything in this one. Also crows. Lots and lots of crows. Ah, I love this jump. There we go. Alright. So, jump up here and jump down. Don't die, don't die, don't die. There we go. <laughs> Uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, this came out just a year after the first one did. And uh, as you can tell, her boobs are less triangular and more circular. <laughs> and here's a tiger. Gotcha. Alright. Ah, oh, shit. And her voice is a little more... Hmm, how do I put that? It's a little more rugged. Would that be the word? Like when she's pushing stuff, she's like, eh! <laughs> and also, she doesn't put her boot in the lock to unlock it. She kind of steps back a bit. Oh no. Yep. Uh, expect a lot of new enemies in this game. Can I make it up there without climbing? Yes, I can. And those little things that I'm shooting right now are spiders. Uh -huh. I'm not sure if it's this one or the third one, but there is a level. Like, I think it's a secret place, but I'm not sure. And... 
I'm not even kidding, there's these huge fucking spiders that you can come across. They're fucking massive. <laughs> it's kind of scary. I know you're not supposed to be scared of like a hundred polygons or anything like that, but you know. It's me. Uh -huh. I'm scared of anything really. Especially the yetis on this one. Jesus. Terrifying those things. <sighs> also, the save system is a lot different than the first one. You don't go around looking for save crystals. Um, you've actually got a save book. Which means you can save whenever you want, wherever you want. The problem with this, though, is when my dad used to play it, he used to... he didn't like watching Lara die. That thing is annoying. <laughs> he didn't like watching Lara die, so he would always load right before he'd see her die. But a, a lot of times he actually used to save it instead of loading it. So whenever he actually loaded it, he'd just like watch her repeatedly kill herself, pretty much. Yeah, there's a lot more, like, boulders and traps and stuff like that. Oops, did I just miss that? Oh shit, yes I did. Oh shit. Whew. That's the first time I've ever missed that. Shit, I should really have saved it, shouldn't I? Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up! I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Woo! <laughs> Fuck! Ah, that's my mud pack's gone. Yep. Ah! Okay, now I'm gonna save it. <sighs> yep. You can see how we made the mistake, though. Kind of. Can I get that small med pack? I think so. Calling it close. Uh huh. Woo! Go! Come on. Where are you all? Should be another one, yeah. <gasps> Fuck me, that was close. Okay. I've already had two near death experiences. I don't want another one. Well, actually, called off three now. Probably gonna have another one down here. I think you'd enjoy this part. I freaking don't. <clears throat> Flares. Uh -huh. Just what I needed, because I keep bloody wasting them. As I said, they're different controls to the first one, so it's a little, um, actually, let's get a flare first. It's a bit different to the first one. Not by much, but, um, there's different weapons, um, different enemies. Before I go in there, you know me, I'm a safe hole. I don't care. <laughs> but if you guys knew what was about to come, you would do the same thing. I'm telling you now. Bring it on, motherfucker! Where is he? There he is. Fucking hell, that's loud. Ooh. Stay.
Stop! Please die. And he's dead. Yay! Now let's go get what he was hiding. I can hear the tigers above me. Also, I know I just picked up the grenade launcher, but I am going to use it because I am not. Oh, I was going to say I'm not wasting ammo, but that's not the point, is it? I wasted a bullet because she jumped up in the air and shot the motherfucking floor. So that's it for now. Well, not it for the episode. <laughs> I mean, that's it for... Where the fuck is... The oh, there it is. And we climb back up. All the way to the top. I wish I could fast forward it, you know. Because it takes a long fucking time. Alright. But yeah, she starts off in China, makes her way through Venice, and then all these other places. Throw that down there. Safety drop. Ah, oh, that little fucker. Oh no! I'm not wasting my last grenade on a goddamn spider. It's gnawing at my legs! Motherfucker. Let's go! Yeah! Yeah, this is the first time these were introduced to the game as well. I'll be okay for now. Ow. Right then, I'm going to show you something before we actually go to the end, which is that dot over there. Right. The laptop doesn't come out of nowhere. It's right there. And the weird lighting is because of that fire which is there. And I would love to know why there is actually a laptop there. And the dude comes from up there. But you can actually go up. But anyways, let's finish this level off. Jump! Don't you fucking dare crash. Pardon me, if that was just your way of trying the doors for me. <laughs> With a tommy gun on my keyring. Though not anymore. So after you. Somehow, you don't behave like you got the monk's blood. I understand that somehow is in my favor. So indulge me about the dagger. I'd be indebted with your life. These doors are waiting for the right one. The right time to arrive. And then the dagger's blade will honor the hearts of those who believe. So unless you pledge your loyalty as well. And which one is that? To the sins and fortunes of Marco Bartoli.
Perhaps not just yet, then. Aha. Uh -huh. Gianni Bartelli. Via Caravelli, Venice. Alright, guys. I hope you enjoyed the first part, pretty much. The first level <laughs> of Tomb Raider 2. And... Well, I'll be right back with the level two. Yeah. Thank you for watching, guys, and stay tuned for some more videos. Bye!